Hi guys, Saiz here, back with another interesting special series video. And today in this video, I'm gonna talk about top 10 best open source apps. Yeah, guys, in which some apps are very interesting and some are also very useful. So watch this video till the end. And if you're new on this channel, then don't forget to subscribe. Also join our Telegram channel where I provide important files and updates. So without any wasting of time, let's begin. Okay, start with first application. The application name is Kiwi Browser. Yeah, guys, this application is very interesting. This browser contains a lot of features. Like here it is, as we can see, a extension option is present. Yeah, guys, you can add a Chrome extension and a different type of extensions. So you can access a different type of extensions. And uh, if you go on developer options, you can see a very interesting option, block ads. Yeah, guys, with the help of this option, you can block a different type of ads. Also present a different type of option is present like you can change search engine and a lot of options is present like uh, theme, you can set a different type of themes, toolbar option is also present and a lot of features very useful. So definitely go for this browser because this is very interesting and useful browser. Also you can uh, see here it is a safe browsing mode is also present like standard enhanced mode like this type of options is present. So definitely go for this browser. This browser name is Kiwi browser. Okay, now talking about next application, this application is dark node. As the name suggests, <laughs> the interface is dark, not only dark, you can set a different type of interface like light mode also present. Okay, and uh, yeah, here it is the very simple, op uh, very simple app. You can add a different type of notes, you can change fonts of notes, you can change your color. Okay, now talking about next application, which is very useful and interesting. This is the online music streaming open source application. Yeah, guys, this is VTune. Uh, a lot of options is also present, like I'm hearing this Lamborghini song. So here it is, you can redirect this song. You can see, you can watch this song directly on YouTube. Just simply you need to click on this watch on YouTube option. Also equalizer option is present and youtube music option is also present and a lot of settings lot of features is present like this uh, supporting material you and different type options is also present okay now talking about next application which is used for checking your device environment like this okay so this is the securify okay this is the application where uh, it tell us what is the uh, our present situation of our device environment like my device is rooted so it says su is present magisk zygisk and my device is on custom right so my device is not encrypted like that this type of options this type of environment what is the our actual environment it shows the these all things okay so this is very useful applications the application name is securify now talking about next application this is uh, this application name is breeze yeah uh, I think I am not taking the application name is proper, but application name is Breeze. Okay, so this is the uh, normal uh, music player application. As we can see, this application supports Material U, and uh, a lot of different type of option is present. Like it's a systematic options is present, like album, music, playlist, etc. Okay. Now talking about next application, the application name is metadata remover. Yeah, guys, uh, if we click any photos or pictures, like here it is at three options is present pictures, videos and documents. So simply this application remove the metadata. So what is the metadata as we can see here? It is the different type of time or date or what is the device which where this uh, photo is clicked. So this type of metadata is removed with the help of this application. Yeah, guys, very useful application. If you want to protect your some confidential information like time, date or whatever you want. Okay, so this is the useful very application and you can uh, remove any metadata like I removed metadata from this application. As we can see the time and date is not showing right our previous picture is shown the metadata, but on this picture not showing because we removed with the help of metadata application. 
now talking about next application the application name is key pass so when you open this uh, key pass application you need to put a password for this special app lock password for this application okay what is the use of this application uh, you can uh, save a different type of account passwords on here or you can also create or you can generate different type of length of passwords with the help of this application yeah i guess this application useful for two things okay so as we can see i already saved the one of my account password that is fb password so you can save a different type of account passwords and here it is a different option is present that is a password generator so you can generate a different length of password here so very useful application uh, i'm not suggest you for saving different type of passwords but definitely go for if you want to generate different type of passwords yeah guys and also here it is a different options is present like uh, backup password also present okay so you can if you forgot then you can backup that passwords also now talking about next application the application name is focus go this is a very very simple gallery application yeah guys very simple nothing much more here as we can see how we can see uh, the information of photo and delete it or add to favorite or share or you can set a different type of um, grids okay so this is the very simple application very simple not any advanced feature is present on this application but is very simple now talking about next application uh, this application name is dio hub okay dio hub what we call okay so this what is this application this is the unofficial uh, this is the open source application but unofficial github mobile client application yeah guys uh, you can access mobile version like uh, you can see pages in mobile version so it will good for good to see the different type of github pages diff github repositories okay so i search simply vi music and as we can see i can access the mi music repository like that we can read it and you can uh, download it but it will redirect you on that chrome browser or whatever browser which you have okay so this is very useful uh, if you want a mobile version of github so very interesting now talking about very useful and very important application this is open source application the application name is launch chat yeah guys if you want to message anyone without saving her his number so this is very useful application so with the help of this application you can simply type your country code and your phone number of whatsapp or signal or telegram whatever you want to send okay and simply put the message and after that you can simply send it it's very simple without saving her his contact you can send message to anyone yeah guys very useful as we can see i i'm not installed any whatsapp application on my device so that's why it shows but you can simply send without saving anyone number okay so these are the 10 open source apps if you like this video then please like and share this video see you in the next video love you guys goodbye take care